The Lost Cyclist is, is sort of a follow-up to my first book, Bicycle, The History. It's a more uh, focused look at, at the great bicycle boom and one of the leading characters in it, a certain Frank Lenz who set off to circle the world on this newfangled safety bicycle and never made it. Frank Lenz was a famous, what we'd call today a cycle tourist, somebody who loved to travel uh, on his wheel, uh, meet new people, go to foreign countries, relished in, in the fame he had as a correspondent, no doubt a bit reckless. The other part of the book, besides sort of a, a travelogue um, tracking Lenz's adventures and misadventures, is uh, the investigative part, that is, um, I track another cyclist, William Sockleben, who was hired by Outing Magazine, Lenz's sponsor, to go find Lenz after it was clear that he said something had gone terribly wrong. These two cyclists, Lenz and Sockleben, they're both really pioneers who, um, who helped uh, usher in the great uh, bicycle boom, um, that transition from the elitist high wheeler, which was kind of an amusing toy for young athletic males, uh, to the modern bicycle, which became not just uh, a popular uh, recreational vehicle, but a vehicle of some utility. You know, the new safety bicycle really uh, promised to open up this world of cycling to the general population. 